We're still following breaking news this morning. The Tulsa Fire Department is investigating a fire at a chemical plant at the Port of Catoosa. Two Works View reporter Ashley Holt joins us live once again with an update. Good morning, Ashley. Good morning, Will. We just spoke to firefighters who said that they are headed back inside the building just to make sure that all of those small fires and hot spots are completely out at this point. That's the reason why they're still kind of hanging out here. They've been going in and out. They just went back in about five of them. They were telling us how they are trained on situations like this. Them and Hazmat work together on a monthly basis to make sure that they know how to address fires that happen at the Port of Catoosa because you obviously have two main concerns. It's going to be the people inside and then if chemicals are involved, that could obviously make things a lot worse. And when we talked to firefighters this morning, here's what they had to say about if chemicals were involved this morning. That particular company has four buildings here on site. The building here is mainly offices with a few finished products in it. Most of the chemicals that we were worried about were housed in other, one of the other three buildings and they've been remotely shut down and we're monitoring them. The Tulsa Fire Department is responsible for investigating this fire since it is the Tulsa port of Catoosa. So we're waiting on the fire marshal to come out here and try to figure out what exactly caused this fire because they're not sure just yet. But the good news right now, as far as they know, chemicals not involved. The three people inside were able to make it home. OK, we'll stay out here and when we know the cause of that fire, we'll get you that information right away. Reporting live out of Catoosa, Ashley Holt, two works for you.